going to make a video about friendship, but I'm easily distracted and I was looking stuff up on the internet and I found that seaweed, this stuff, this is dried seaweed from Kame, is really good for your skin. So I'm going to try putting it on my skin. I don't know how I'm going to, because it's all like dried up, but somehow I'm going to get it on my skin and see what happens. So I put the wakami mixed up with some aloe vera gel and some tea tree oil and what else? Oh yeah, agave syrup. These are all things that I found in my cupboard. Sometimes wonder about my cupboard. It's like a magic wonderland of, of, of stuff. I, I didn't have to go out to put any of those stuff in my face pack that I just made. And now I'm looking like this, which is, oh, bits of it falling off. So, so this is like wakame seaweed which I bought ages ago from a Japanese shop, a uh, Japanese grocery shop, and haven't used. You can put it, it's usually in miso soup. It's like the bottom of miso soup. So you know that green stuff that sort of just expands. It's just a sort of lake with bits of pondweed in it. Well, this is the pondweed, but it's, it's seaweed, not pondweed. Pondweed might work. I don't know. There's a lot of pondweed in my pond. It might work, but I, I, I've got seaweed, so that's all right. And, and also my pond stinks at the moment. So, so I don't know if this is just completely falling off. I don't know if this is going to help, but apparently it's got some sort of thing that helps, uh, it's an ingredient that helps uh, keep your skin youthful and also treats acne and various other blemishes. So it, it's hopefully going to make my skin softer and not green. I don't know. See, this is if you open it up, there, bit of it. That's that basically, I've put leaves green leaves all over my head. So I've taken it off and my skin is still on my face which is always a plus point. I'm not sure whether it's done any other good but um, maybe my skin's more glowing, maybe it's more vibrant, vibrant is that a word that you use for skin? Radiant, maybe that's the word that's more appropriate. So I'm not sure whether you should use it or not if you're helping to improve your skin you, uh, it, it can't do any harm. I suppose, unless you're allergic to it, in which case it can, but uh, if you've got it, why not put it on your face? And if you haven't got it, then I wouldn't go out of your way to get it, but you can if you want. That's all. Okay, bye. <laughs>